the stick, you've got to drop that right, that wide right hand out here to the, to the hip. Okay? Come on, Charles. Breathe deep. Breathe deep. And you've got to go Let's to the take a look board. at that knockdown. Right We're right getting hand. conflicting reports from that referee. See, that's that overhand to the back of the head, and that one, while he was down already, is what should have cost him the point. Well, I'll tell you, that's what did cost him the point. And N Norris was disqualified once for the same thing. Now Those watch. punches on top of the head, here, he's clearly down on top of the head, and that's where the point came from. That, that could have been dangerous. If they, they could have clearly disqualified him, and that would have really been dangerous. That disqualification came against a fighter named Joseph Walker uh, in 1987. Yes, it has happened before. Also against Donald Curry and Sugar Ray Leonard. Well, this is a guy that's all wound up and, and with evil intention, as Tyson used to say. And when he punches, he punches to the very end. He's a determined fighter, a rough guy. There's another right hand by Terry Norris. Troy Waters, to his credit, comes back with a nice combination. He's demonstrating a pretty good chin and some, I'll tell you what, some real determination. Norris oh. goes down! Unbelievable! What a turn of events! He's in trouble! He's, He's in big trouble! It came out of nowhere! Oh, my God! It's unbelievable. The right uppercut he told us about earlier. He hit him with it, and look at what we have in front of us. He was just, I thought it was a low blow. He had landed, but he, he hit him with an uppercut, and the legs went out from Terry Norris. Would this be the upset of the year? No, it would be up to the decade. Norris looking to shake it off and comes back. Now to the head of Troy Waters. But Waters Terry Norris uses to go down. Terry Norris's head is cleared up now, but I'll tell you what, Troy Waters, if he weathers the storm, he's got to have a certain amount of adrenaline in his, behind him because of that knockdown. And Terry is wearing out. He is wearing out. He's throwing everything he's got. He hurt Terry again. He hit him with a left uppercut, and Terry fell right into him. What a game, Troy Waters, the well, way through the second. He keeps hitting low, does Troy Waters. That's taking a lot out of him also. In all the action, they haven't said anything about a low blow, but he's getting hit a lot as Terry Norris. Well, I'll tell you right now, Terry really wants to get this guy out of here. More than anything else, he's probably got him embarrassed as well in his hometown. And I'll tell you what, this is one game kick. Well, he's on the way now. But he has given Terry a big scare. Less than a minute remaining in round two. What an incredible turnaround. And Look at this exchange. I'll tell you, you have to admire Destroy Waters. He has withstood an unbelievable onslaught, and here he is punching. And taking punches. Wow, what he's taking, Bobby. Should have knocked anybody out. But back comes Waters. This crowd in a frenzy, most of them standing. And most of them in disbelief. Norris must be thinking, what do I have to do to get rid of this guy? Well, I'll tell you not only that, the kid is coming back with good solid punches. Oh, oh no. His quest for pound for pound best. It's a right hand right to the across. temple, right across to the temple yes. of his head. And I think the punch before that might have had done something. But come, Norris comes back scared as he must have been and embarrassed as he must have been. He came back with everything he had. But the Australian was there at the end. He was still standing. What a display of guts. What a tremendous round.